Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Let's talk about it, Media 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and please hit the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you will be the first one to see it. No, all comments are alleged and our opinion and for entertainment purposes only, where we discuss celebrity news, celebrity gossip, what's going on on IG and Google, and what's the hot topic for the day or the week. Fair use. Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976. Allowances made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comma, comments, comma, news reporting, comma, teaching, comma, scholarships, and research. Fair use is use permitted by a copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. All comments are alleged in our opinion and for entertainment purposes only. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Don't forget to like, to comment but be kind and also turn on the notification bell that way every time I upload a video you'll be the first one to see it also the cash app is let's talk about it media and thank you all for your love and support so let's get into it over the last few days the K's and the J's have been in the media recently Kim went to Harvard of course Kanye is either married or engaged Many people are wishing him well because I think it's in the step to the right direction on trying to find peace, to separate himself from the chaos, the drama, and the issues. Because just in the last five, six days, it's always been drama, conflicts, and issues. Constant, every week, every week, every week. And we talk about it because as things go on, if we don't report on it, then people will say, okay, why are they letting this go? Why are they letting get that go? Why are they, why, 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 why? So let's get into one. He's now married allegedly. And people are saying, congratulations. That's good. He moved on fast. <laughs> he just got a divorce month, two months ago and moved on. He has somebody that's going to be a filter, a helpmate, a partner, Somebody to talk to, period. Somebody that he can confide in, someone allegedly that the children have already met or talked to. So then she put out a few IG posts. And then everybody's talking about Pete in regards to him removing the tattoos. And then everybody's talking about Kylie breaking up with Travis. Then everybody's saying they're making all these posts, making statements for Tristan Thompson. And then we have her going to Harvard. People went in. My Harvard video, I'm trying not to laugh. My Harvard video, I could not stop laughing. Because what's transpiring is this. They're using different locations as a storyline. Because it was mentioned that they didn't really know. And did all those people in that classroom have to sign NDAs? Mind you, there was only about maybe 30, 40 people outside. Could have been a part of their team, too. You think about it, because they don't travel alone. So it could have been a part of their team being outside, because we wouldn't know the difference. So mind you, did all those people have to sign NDAs? I wouldn't have signed none. I just would have, wouldn't have been in class. Hey, girl, put me on speaker so I can hear what's going on. So allegedly, it was a lecture. And allegedly, like I said, they didn't know. So she spoke about certain things. She spoke about certain things in regards to business. And I think it's a way to try and get one, a storyline, two, more customers, three, to put it out there because maybe people are falling off. Now, mind you, I did a video two weeks ago in regards to customers concerns customer complaints and like I said I don't know true false I don't know if people are purchasing the wrong size I don't know support the business don't support the businesses that's up, totally up to you I'm not telling you not to support and I'm not telling you not to buy but recently people have been concerned about the Balenciaga thing and maybe people are not purchasing a lot of uh, items from the K or a J and maybe this is why, too, when uh, one of the girls wore a dress 
and then it was alleged Kim posted something, tag me or at me, whatever. So then the next day, Kim wanted to put on makeup in a in a interesting way. She could do whatever she wants. She could post whatever she wants. Many people are saying, oh, that's the silly side. Oh, she's not trying to be sexy. No, she wants media attention. She wants, you know, the click and the view. So then we have the Harvard thing. Then we have Kylie going to Paris to walk the show because, you know, she just broke up with Travis Scott. Now, mind you, many people are saying they're surprised that they finally allegedly broke up. But then there was also sources saying, oh, they broke up before. They'll probably get back together soon. So if you check out some of my other videos, I don't know if he wants to come back. And if he does, he may. And people say allegedly, 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 are these men, some of them, under contract? Are they? Now, she's stuck by him through Kylie. Stuck by Travis Scott through all the Astro World issues, comments, concerns, people allegedly passing. That was a total travesty. Never should have happened. When people were screaming, stop the show, they should have stopped the show. Being in the audience as her and Ky uh, Kendall were, they should have been able to contact his team saying, I'm concerned. Now, mind you, remember how Kylie took a picture of the ambulance. You think that's not going to show up in court? The ambulance is out there. He should have removed himself off stage. Prior. This is my opinion. All comments are alleged. Fair use. He should have stopped the show immediately once he saw that. Now, mind you, it's being alleged that the police spoke with Travis Scott before all the issues. And I guess people uh, pushed through the gates, allegedly. I don't know. But of course, everything's going to come out. When the court case comes up, I will follow it. So this is the biggest thing. People were going in in regards to her being at Harvard. They're trying to find better storylines because people are tired of the unhealthy relationships we see, we hear, and that's being talked about. And you see that they're pushing more so over the narrative of themselves versus pushing the narrative in regards to Courtney. Now, even though Courtney seems happy, at peace, they still want to make it seem like she's not that happy and it's interesting. And Travis Barker just got a huge tattoo on his leg of Courtney in her eyes or something like that. But here or there, people were going in in regards to her being at Harvard and her seeking moments in regards to a click and a view. I think the shift is happening. I think there is a point where people are saying they're not as welcoming. They're not as uh, famous as they were. They're not as respected. Now, it's being said that Kim allegedly is getting a lot of bad press. No matter what she do, what she say, there's a lot of issues. And then people are saying she may be stressed out. Remember times she's allegedly dealt with anxiety, this and that, 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 that. Now, not knowing her medical issue, not knowing, but people are saying, is she okay? In regards to the hair loss, her hair was thinning about two years ago, but then it looked like she had a bob, but then she had the issue where she dyed her hair around the time she was dating Pete. Mm, mm, okay, but in nor, here nor there, we don't know the medical issue, not a doctor, not a counselor, not a bears or a shame, but a lot of people weren't feeling and they're going to try and make it seem like the news, the media, people were feeling the um, the visit. Now, will any of the people speak on it? I haven't really heard anyone say good, bad, ugly, or indifferent. Um, you know, she's the only one that spoke. The other person, now mind you, she's in the business with other people. But it seems as if she's taken the grunt of the business and thinking, making people think she's the main person that owns it but here nor there um it's basically saying she gave a lecture um they're saying that your trolls are brutal online because we know that is to push the narrative of seeking 
things to maybe turn around in regards to items they sell. And this is the biggest thing. People are saying, why should we continue to make y'all rich when people are struggling? Prices of groceries have gone up. Um, things are just different. And I don't think they understand that. They're flying around in their jets. People talk about the water use they've used over the last several years. People are saying, why is LA like that? You guys are that rich. How many is it of y'all? And y'all trying to push the narrative of trying to get everybody to be billionaires, allegedly. And people are saying, LA doesn't have to be that way. It doesn't. It doesn't. They could have had a building or two, men's, women, take some of the items that they have. They can have, uh, get those people off the street. They can have uh, seminars, whatever. I don't want to give advice because they may use my ideas, but here nor there. People are, are basically brutal online and they're talking about her using things to get a click and a view. Now, mind you, many people were saying, what is she going to talk about? Unless she talks about how she got there, what's going on, her friendship, her relationships. This is the biggest thing. Yes, you can have a successful business, but you've been able to have that. And how do you feel about and how do you handle and do you feel that you've copied off people? Do you feel that your name and Lori Harvey's name is too close for comfort? Whatever happened in regards to the African-American woman that actually had very similar name too. whatever happened in regards to that. Because mind you, whenever they do interviews or they do stuff, they already have questions that they will or won't answer. We need to have for them to get in front of people that there's no question you can't ask. Let me do an interview. Trust and believe I will go in. And mind you, not everybody has a healthy relationship. Not everybody is married. Not everybody has had situations. But we are concerned because there have been so many, so many situations we see regarding Scott, regarding Lamar Odom, regarding Kanye saying the medical concerns he went through. Lamar talked about th different things he was taking. Kanye talked about different things he was taking. Hello, didn't didn't catch that. And that's their medical concerns, you know. And then they drag Chris Humphreys like he was, you know, why was you with him? Why would you marry him? You know, so that's the biggest thing. So then we have the situation where Kylie is wearing this noose around her neck. And then we have where the Kardashians say the only KKK to ever let black men in. This was a post from Chloe from many years ago. So Kylie wants some attention. Chloe wanted some attention. This is an old post she posted and she took it down. But I'm wondering if Kim, when she goes back, if she goes back, and other colleges, I, I, I think Harvard got dragged. Why are they doing this? It's 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 a ploy. It's a PR. Oh my goodness! This is how they're gonna try and get more storylines. Don't let them come into colleges. They're just gonna use it and and be trying to do stuff. People were going in. So this is the other thing, Kylie, and this concerning necklace. Many people are going in, and until they stop insulting, making fun of, if you know the history of what African-American men, women, and people went through, if you didn't do what you were asked to do, this is something that people would be found, and this would be something that changed a whole family in a sad way. So for her to put this on, and she put it on after she broke up with Travis. I'm sure Travis is upset. I wonder how Travis feels. I wonder how Tristan feels. I wonder how Malika feels. I wonder how Lala feels. I wonder how all their friends that are African-American feels. I wonder how Kanye feels about her having this necklace on. Who else? I wonder how Kendall's ex feels about her having this necklace on. So let's see how many people continue to support this kind of situation. Now, mind you, I put the two together because... Chloe saying this, the K, 
and then she's doing the neck thing. You know what this means. The two are tied together. So everyone focus on healthy, safe relationships. Be loving, be kind, be supportive. They play in people's faces and they're seeking storylines. And a lot of times their storylines are guys they dated. So well wishes, people be safe, be kind, be considered. Healthy relationships are important. Find people that are strong in mind, body, soul, and spirit. Be loving, be kind, and be supportive to your friends. Thanks for tuning in. Let me know in the comments how you feel about how she's getting dragged for going to Harvard, trying to use Harvard for a storyline or to push the alleged products. And maybe I think they had an assignment. Everyone, be safe, be good, be kind.